Hello everyone and welcome to Mountain Lake Journal. I'm Tom Halleck. This week, scientists have unleashed a new weapon in the fight against an invasive species that has spread for the first time into the Adirondacks. Hundreds of these predatory beetles were released just a few weeks ago in forests near Paradise Bay on Lake George. It is hoped the beetles, along with pesticides, will help kill off the hemlock woolly adelgid, a tiny invasive species that threatens millions of hemlock trees in the Adirondack Park. So this is going to be a multi-year project. Um, so we're going to be out here for five plus years to come keep looking, keep retreating trees. A team of scientists from New York's Department of Environmental Conservation and Cornell University have teamed up to try to slow the advance of the woolly adelgid. And we've seen it uh, completely wipe out uh, hemlocks, which would have a huge effect, especially in an area like Lake George um, that has such a large component of hemlocks in the forest. We're trying to control this pest and aggressively attack it so that we um, can reduce its spread and the impact in the area. The adelgid is a really small um, insect that you have to look under a magnifying glass to see. So it's very difficult to see with the naked eye. Over time, it will produce a woolly mass on the needles, uh, right at the base of that needle of that tree. I mean, you look around the lake here and it's like there's hemlocks everywhere. The best case scenario is that we're successful in knocking down the populations up here now uh, in Paradise Bay and that we can forestall the development of uh, populations that are going to be killing trees and that basically will buy time for the long-term solution in my mind which is uh, the implementation of the biological controls. In the spring, Dr. Mark Whitmore, an entomologist with Cornell University, also plans to release another natural predator, these tiny silver flies that feed on the woolly adelgid. He hopes the flies and beetles will curtail the spread and help manage the adelgid population. 